my testosterone was through the roof. My cortisol level was non-existing. <laughs> so I was having these fluctuations all over the place. And I couldn't yeah. understand because when you're checking all the right boxes and you think you're doing all the right things and it's, and it's actually going up, you're, you know, it's just so defeating. When I was feeling at my lowest, I went to an endocrinologist because you think of like, hey, listen, there's something going on. And when I originally went to her, she, that's when my testosterone was through the roof. And I was like, okay, wait a minute. There's something not right. I said, well, what am I supposed to do? I'm still gaining weight. And she said, I'll just give you a weight loss drug. And I was so wow. angry at her. Wow. I was so yeah. mad at her. And then I went to a hormone specialist and I was like, okay, maybe they'll do some testing. And that's when I started the 40 program. And my, actually it was my hormone specialist that I went to. She had me on, um, I was on anxiety medication. When I went to the hormone specialist, she goes, let me put you on some progesterone and some adrenal. There's, I started the program and my hormonal doctor was watching this weight loss happen. She's like, I don't want you to do any labs until you're fully off the program. You're in maintenance in real life. Like what, it, what do we see? And mm -hmm. so we tested it back in January. So I had a plenty of time in maintenance. And so my cortisol level is like ideal range. I mean, I'll be 45 and it, it, I mean, it was in the tank and obviously that's why I was feeling horrible across the board and no energy. And then my testosterone is now perfect. She said, I'm off progesterone. I'm off adrenal medication, I'm off anxiety medication. I'm on nothing. And she says, mm. I don't want you to do anything, but continue to eat like you're eating and keep doing what you're doing. You don't need to be on anything. Your blood yeah. work is as good as a 30 year old. <clears throat> I really feel, you know, by uh, God's grace and everything that I was presented this plan. Uh, I started the program in September, actually Labor Day weekend last year. Um, now I've been off it and now it's almost March 1st. I've lost about 20 to 25 pounds and I've been maintaining since then for the last four months, I'll be 45 this year, body fat decreased over 6%. My waist itself, I've lost seven inches on my waist. I've lost five inches just off my hips alone. My mm -hmm. metabolic age is from 48 to 38 and my BMI dropped from 26 to 21. When I say an actual hormonal reset, and I've obviously preached to anybody and everybody that can listen when I see them trying to do all these other things, you have to do something that's going to change your lifestyle and change your habits. And I think that that's where this program is so different than everything else. I work with a nutritionist. He's giving my, my meals. He's not, there's no coaching involved and there's nothing else about what you're trying to accomplish besides being in a calorie deficit. That is not a good thing. <laughs> and I wish more people knew that.